St. Louis Cardinals are getting involved in Missouri politics to try and push a sports betting bill through the Senate, where it stalled. Our political editor, Mark Maxwell, sat down with Cardinals President Bill DeWitt III to hear his pitch to politicians. Mark. Mike, if the Senate leaves town in Jefferson City without legalizing sports betting, Cardinals President Bill DeWitt says the organization is exploring a push to put that question to voters on the 2024 ballot. And that's something that might drive youth turnout higher. We talked to younger 20-somethings, Cardinals fans outside Bush Stadium today who said they might not vote in every election, but they'd show up for that one. Would something like that get younger people to go vote? For sure, for sure. Yeah, if they put it on the ballot, I'd be okay with that. We think it's a winning issue in Missouri. Uh, we know we have the votes in the House because it already passed. And we know we have the votes in the Senate based on our discussions in the Senate. We have one senator standing in the way who can filibuster it, and that's Denny Hoskins. Um, that's why this is so frustrating. So it's not politics, it's business. Well, it's uh, politics, business, whatever you want to call it. <laughs> it's the intersection of the two. How much would legal sports betting mean to the Cardinals' bottom line? Well, I think, first of all, um, it would unlock and open up a, a nice sponsorship category for us from a corporate sales standpoint. Um, you know, the sports betting operators would certainly want to reach our fans. I mean, we, we would want to do that tastefully and not overdo it. But um, the second way is I think that um, it creates additional engagement if, with probably a younger demographic. Do you have any ballpark estimate at all what it would mean to the Cardinals organization, the round numbers? We would, like I said, mostly just get a nice bump in, a, in the sponsorship category. Can you make the argument that with a little extra revenue, a little extra money to go around, you might be able to field a more competitive ball club? Is that a, an argument that might resonate in Jefferson City? Um, we've tried that one. <laughs> we've tried everything um, in Jeff City. It sounds like you're saying it could make a difference. I think it could, yeah. I mean, you know, it, it's, it's a new business and it's a new industry, so it remains to be seen to what extent. But I think... Um, it would definitely increase our revenue streams, no question. Missouri Republicans are also working to raise the threshold to make it harder for voters to approve a ballot question. That could end up playing a factor here if Senator Hoskins kills this proposal in the Senate. We offered him an interview, but he didn't respond.